people so welcome back again so today we are making hair growth oil or you can call it beer growth oil because this oil is going to grow the beer and at the same time anything air this oil is going to make you have hair grow a fuller beer or help you grow a fuller hair if you have um, scanty edges this oil is going to help you grow a fuller edges and a thicker hair and you're going to start seeing results from seven days so let me show you how i'm going to make this oil so this is one of the main ingredients i'll be using i'll be using now uh, fresh garlic you can equally use the uh, powdered garlic or the dry one yeah but i'm using the fresh one so i still have other ingredients i'll be adding in here so watch the video to the end and please don't forget to like and share this video please make sure there are no water in uh, your garlic uh, when you rinse it allow the garlic to air dry so that water will not get into the oil you're making and make sure that your grater is also dry so i'm going to uh, grate all the garlic so this is my garlic this is my shredded garlic so next i'll be needing my rosemary herb I'm going to be using uh, my glass jar so put your glass jar on the scale uh, because I need to weigh out the herbs inside here and I also need to weigh out my oils okay so you're going to put your your glass jar on the scale please if you're following me on this page uh, or on this um, channel kindly please get a skill skill is not expensive get a skill okay uh, because most of the time this is what what i work with i work with my skill so set your skill to zero once you put your glass jar on your skill you need to set your skill to zero so right here we'll be weighing out our herbs uh, first of all i'm going to add in my shredded garlic into my glass jar and i am adding two grams of my shredded garlic you can use dry garlic powder if you don't have uh, raw garlic then this is my rosemary herb yeah so i'm going to be adding two gram of my rosemary herb into my so that's two gram of my rosemary herb and next this is my castor oil i am using castor oil because trust me castor oil on its own can grow your hair it can help you grow a thicker and a fuller hair so i'm adding in my castor oil take back your skill to to zero I'm making 100 ml of this oil. So next, I'm going to give this a nice stir. Okay. So next, I'm going to uh, place this on my double boiler because I need to infuse this egg. So I need to cover this up. So here is my oil. I'm done infusing my oil and trust me the whole of the places is just smelling of garlic but it smells nice though. So here is my oil and the next thing I'm going to do right now is for me to actually sieve the oil. So I'm sieving the oil because I need to um, get a clear oil and as you can see you can see uh, the rosemary herb you can see the garlic another method you can actually do is for you to 
Fridays but because I don't want to kill the potency of my castor oil if you're using another kind of oil like coconut oil you can actually fry and uh, wh while frying please make sure that you don't burn your herbs or you don't burn your garlic but just fry until all the herbal extract in the garlic and rosemary I've extracted into the oil. This method I'm doing right now is actually one of the fastest method. It's called a double boiling method. So if you don't want to sieve your herb after double boiling your herbs, you can equally leave your herb in your glass jar for like two weeks, three weeks, one week, and allow it to infuse more before you sieve it. So for me, I double boiled this herb i did my own double boiling method for about one hour yeah for about one hour so you can equally leave this in the jar allow it to sit down and infuse for like two weeks more but because i want to use this oil now i can't wait for that but the more it infused the better or the more effective this oil become all right so can you see the oil so i'm going to allow this oil cool down and i'm going to add in another ingredient so i'm checking my oil to see the temperature and right now my oil has cooled down so i'm going to add in the next ingredient so like i said um the more the herb infused the more effective the your oil becomes all right so right away i am adding in my vitamin e oil you can equally add in vitamin e capsule and yes i am weighing out my oil i actually added 0.5 gram of my vitamin e oil because i did 100 gram of my air oil or my beer growth oil or my air growth oil so give it a nice stir give it a good nice stir trust me this oil smells lovely now i'm going to just look for a container so next i'm going to bottle up my air growth oil then i'm using a bottle that has a nozzle so that it will be easy for me to apply on the beer or on the air And another thing, vitamin E is very, very important because remember we're not adding preservative into this oil. So vitamin E is going to help preserve your oil. And that is why vitamin E is very, very essential for this hair oil. And apart from that, vitamin E helps your hair a lot. Your hair needs vitamin E. So thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and share the video. And I'm going to see you in my next one.